What's up, everybody? This is Project Freak, Volume 2, Series 2, whatever you want to call it. Um, we're getting our first workout video in. PJ Braun, who's usually here with me, I'm PJ Braun. is out of town. And uh, so Sammy's filling in. We're going to do a back workout today. He's kind of going to just run me through it and like be the PJ for the day. Um, explain Lord uh, Braun. What, what the workouts are like and what we're doing. Hopefully so uh, you guys can watch it and then follow along. Go get yourself a good back workout in. So we're going to get started get with some wide grip pull downs. Wait, come on. Lower. Let's go. Seven weeks out. Squeeze. Hold this one. Two seconds. There you go. Give me two more of those. Last one. Come on. Right there. Fire. Let's get it right into it. Focus the squeeze. Focus the squeeze. Come on. Seven weeks. Seven weeks. Actually, probably 7.5. Keep going. There you go. Good form. Squeeze, squeeze. There you go. By the back. That's four, five, six, seven. Come on. Bang them out. Eight, nine, last one. Come on. Boom. Shit. So right here, we're doing a reverse incline row with a minor hyperextension. With a reverse incline row, you're gonna notice it's gonna hit low lats, but also at the top, it's gonna, at the bottom, it's gonna hit lower back as well, with the minor hyperextension. What that's gonna do is that's gonna allow him to emphasize a better pump in his lower back, where he can bring out more detail in the lower lats and also the lower back. So you guys will notice as he pulls, pulls up. There you go. Squeeze, there you go. Close your eyes and picture a Christmas tree. There you go. Let's go. It's five. Six. There you go. Full stretch. Seven. Fully engage your stretch. There you go. Eight. There you go. Four more. Come on. Nine. Ten. See how it's hitting? You'll notice all this is hitting is lower lats. And the hyperextension is giving that full uh, pump to his lower back as well. Still in this one, pretty good rhymes actually. He didn't invent it, but I am taking it from him from watching him do it. But I'm gonna do some uh, Smith Machine bent over row, overhand grip. Uh, I have my lower back's messed up from my herniated discs and shit. So this is a good exercise where I can do lighter weight, stabilizing muscles. Uh, you know, I, I can really focus on my lat squeeze. Um, and I'm gonna do a dead stop at the bottom of each rep on this, just to reset the muscle. So you get a full contraction at the top, and it resets the muscle, full contraction every every actual rep. And we're only doing like 45 second one minute rest times, so you can't really tell because the way the video is clipped, but that's why I'm on breath. upper back, his upper lat right here, this insertion. See how he emphasizes that squeeze, he's activating more blood into that muscle, and watch it grow. There you go, there you go. 
five, six, seven. There you go. Emphasize the squeeze. Eight, nine. Last one. Okay. Don't stop. Just thought of as I was working out is this: make sure when you're pulling down in any of these exercises, you're pulling with your, as if you're trying to pull from the back of your elbow back and towards you. Because the second I forget to do that, I start squeezing with my forearm and using my bicep, I lose all contraction in my back and in my lats. So make sure you try to, you know, let go of your grip. Just like bare hook. Yeah, like a hook. Just hook the weight and then pull back with your elbows. You get a much better squeeze. Because you feel like he's what now? What he activates if he doesn't do that or he doesn't think about that? He's activating all his secondary muscles, his forearms. So now he's losing tension off his lats. It's all going into here, which is basically going to burn him out. And he's not going to get a full contract, correct? Yep. One. Two. Three. Come on. Four. Come on. Five. Come on. Six. Come on. Seven. Come on. Eight. Drop it. Set. Let's get one. There you go. Two. Three. Four, no failure, five, six, I'm gonna help you a little bit. Seven, there you go. Eight, nine, come on, Maybe 15, 10, 11, 12, there you go, there you go. 13, 14, last one. Good job, Dan. Woo, good set, boy. Good set. Dude, that fucking worked. I should have your back fucking looking like a turtle. Really? Turtle shell. Oh, that was too easy. Should have done another drop set. <laughs> Next on that. Super Saiyan Sammy. AKA Junior Freak Junior. On the angle. Like let it stretch and then pull back. Gotcha. Let it stretch. Go a little lighter. Whoa. Get a better squeeze. Almost fell off the thing. Are you still recording me? Does the freak has anything to say? <laughs> By the way, that's my girlfriend talking in the background. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that's Super Saiyan. Even the freak gets tired. It's kind of freaky that Especially you get tired. Especially the freak gets tired. The freak never gets tired. I'm just <laughs> acting like I'm immortal so the government doesn't find out that a god is living on the planet. So I gotta, you know, make it seem like I fit in, I get tired, sleep and shit. I don't do any of that. I just fucking grow from the fucking sun's rays like Superman. Superman grows from the sun rays? Yeah, from the radiation. Have you never seen Superman? So you have a weakness, then? No. Kryptonian? No. Kryptonite? Nope. No. So that green little glowing rock won't fucking make you No, weak. because I'm not Superman. I have traits like Superman, but also all of his negatives and downfalls, I don't have.